Hey everybody, Tyson Zahner here, and in today's short video, I want to give you the number one tip that I believe I could possibly ever give you if you want to succeed quickly in your business, or really in anything that you want to succeed in. And of course, who doesn't want to get to their goals fast? We all do. And um, I've actually implemented this tip that I'm about to share with you in, in two different businesses, right? Um, I, I implemented it first in my photography business. I'm going to tell you a little bit of story about how I kind of discovered this tip uh, and implemented it in my photography business, and then how I was able to implement this in my network marketing and building my, my network marketing business online. And one of the things a lot of people ask me is, man, Tyson, how did you get to the top of the leaderboards so quickly with no previous online marketing experience. And the tip I'm gonna give you is really the secret for how I did that. So before I get to how I did it in my network marketing business, let me give you a little background by telling you kind of the story about how I built my photography studio. So back in 2000 and really six, seven, eight, I was still a, a public school music teacher. Um, I had done that for, uh, well, since 1999 and by 2006, I was really kind of itching to do something else, and I started to build a photography studio. And one of the things, I, I was building it kind of slowly as a hobby on the side, and then what happened was, I ended up getting a little bit of traction, we were making pretty good money, but I didn't feel it was good enough to actually quit my job. And so, um, Tony Robbins has said, if you want to be successful, find somebody who has achieved the results that you want, copy them, and you'll have what they have, right? You'll get the same results that they have. It's not a direct quote, it's kind of a paraphrase, but that's the gist of, uh, of the quote. And so that's essentially what I did. I found some, first of all, I found somebody who, number one, was doing the kind of photography that I wanted to shoot, right? They were building their business the same way that I wanted to. For example, I didn't want to take photographs of small babies and children, didn't really fit into my personality style. I really wanted to shoot older kids, mainly like high school age kids, high school senior portrait work is really what I, I, I was leaning towards. So I sought out somebody who was really successful in the area of senior portrait work. They had, they shot amazing photos, they, they made a lot of money, they had a studio that was set up similar to how I wanted my studio set up, their style was the way I wanted it to be. So I sought this person out. I studied them some online, I bought a course from them, I bought some products from them, and eventually I ended up saying, hey, can I come to your studio and learn from you? And they said, sure. Uh, we've got a seminar coming up, it was like $750 for the day. I visited their studio for a day, actually I think it was a two-day seminar, and while I was there I took notes and I, I mean, I studied exactly what they did in their business. Now, I came home and in my own business, I took what I learned at his studio. I structured my price list the same way that he did. I changed up some of my shooting and lighting style. I changed up a little bit of the way that we, we show our photographs and our sales process. I basically modeled what he was doing in his studio. And guess what? First of all, within about a week or two, we were already doubling our sales uh, from what we had previously done before we implemented these strategies. And second of all, Within about 12 months, we had done $300,000 in gross photography sales. So what I want you guys to understand is that if you're trying, now th think about for a second, if I had tried to figure out all of that stuff on my own, how much longer would it have taken me to figure out all that stuff through trial and error as opposed to simply finding somebody who had already gotten those results and modeling them, copying what they were doing a lot longer, of course, right? So I don't know why it took me so long to figure this out in the home business industry and in my network marketing business because I had failed for like 15 years in network marketing because I was trying to figure it all out on my own or because I was listening to people who, number one, were not building their business the way I wanted to build my business, my upline, and I was listening to people who had not yet really achieved the results that I wanted. Most of my upline was people who, they had recruited a few people here and there, but they had not built massive success. And I said, well, duh, no wonder I've been failing. If I want to succeed in network marketing and online marketing and I want to do it by attracting people to me, first of all, I need to find somebody who's building their business the same way I want to build it, right? I knew I didn't want to prospect. I knew I didn't want to chase people down or bother family members and friends. Just wasn't how I wanted to build my business. So I sought out somebody who was building their business on the internet, somebody who was really good at attraction marketing because I knew that's how I wanted to build my business. And I found somebody, not just somebody who portrayed themselves as an expert, but who was actually getting the results that I wanted to get 
in my business. And I found somebody who, he was the number one income earner in his network marketing company. He was a massive authority, um, uh, uh, an incredibly um, gifted teacher and trainer. And I said, hey, why, why don't I just follow this guy? He's got the results I want. I'll start modeling and copying what he did. I followed him, I bought some of his courses, and guess what? Within 12 months, I had recruited over a thousand people into my business. I was making a new six-figure income stream all from online attraction marketing strategies. Why? Because I knew what I wanted, I found somebody who had that, and I copied or modeled what they did. So you're probably wondering who I'm talking about. Well, for me, the person that I really modeled was Ray Higdon. And um, if you haven't, well, Ray actually just released a brand new video today. Well, depending on when you're watching this video, it may or not, may not still even be available. But in this video, Ray really teaches exactly how I, what I learned from Ray when I first started out, which was how to attract people to me by positioning myself as an expert. And I'm gonna tell you something real quickly here. First of all, if you wanna watch that video, I strongly suggest you do, it's not very long. You can grab it at successwithtyson.com forward slash 3ME for three minute expert because basically it teaches you how to attract people to you by positioning yourself as an expert in as little as three to five minutes a day, okay? So successwithtyson.com forward slash 3ME for three minute expert. But the, one of the big hurdles I had when I first started following Ray was I thought, well, that's great for you, Ray, because you've had all this success. Of course, people will follow you and see you as an expert because you've had results. What about me? I failed in multiple network marketing companies. I've never recruited anyone. Why would anybody listen to me as an expert? And Ray taught me something that was really pivotal for me. And what he said was, people don't follow you because of your results, right? They follow you, they listen to you because of the results you can help them get. So I took the focus off of me. I, st I didn't talk about me and my results. I simply started learning how to do things that other people were doing and I started sharing it with my audience. I said, hey, here's a tip that I learned today. I didn't say, hey, I've gotten results with this tip. I didn't lie. I simply said, hey, here's a tip that I think will help you with XYZ in your business. They went, wow, this guy's thinking about me. He's not one of those other dorky marketers online who's talking all about themselves and you know showing off their fancy cars, which nobody cares about anyway, right? I simply started helping other people, and guess what? I started attracting people to me. My marketing started to take off, and now I generate 30 to 50 leads a day. Uh, we do $20,000 a month in income, multiple six-figure business, and I don't prospect anybody and it was all really from the strategies that I learned from Ray about how to attract people to me by positioning myself as, a, as, as an expert. And here's the, the last thing I wanna tell you before you go grab his free video is that when, you, when people see you as an authority, selling and recruiting is a thousand times easier. It's so much easier because, I, I've used this analogy before, but think of it like Dr. Oz. When Dr. Oz makes a recommendation on his TV show, or when Oprah Winfrey recommends a book on her TV show, she doesn't have to hard sell that book. She just has to say, hey, this is a really great book, you should pick it up, and guess what? It becomes a bestseller. Or Dr. Oz can say, hey, this is a really good supplement for weight loss, and people are gonna go, it's gonna go flying off the shelves, why? Because Dr. Oz, they see him as an authority, and they go, well, if Dr. Oz recommends it, he's an expert, I'll simply buy it because he recommended it. And that's where the secret to how I've so easily recruited and sold people is that I simply put out these simple little three to five minute pieces of content. It can be a video, it could be a podcast, it could be a, um, it could be a blog article, but simply putting yourself out there and, sh and helping other people, not pointing to yourself and saying, I'm awesome, but rather saying, let me give you some tips to help you with X, Y, Z. And you can do this in any niche, okay? It doesn't, you don't have to position yourself as an expert in marketing or online marketing or network marketing. You could position yourself as an expert in how to save money on travel or how to, uh, how to lose weight or you know, how to invest money more, uh, you know, more intelligently. I mean, there's so many different ways that you can give advice to people. So don't get caught up in thinking you have to do it the exact same way that I have done it or that Ray has done it. It's, a, it's about learning the principles, all right? So go over and watch Ray's video. He teaches you exactly what I learned from him um, not too long ago that really propelled me to success. You can grab that free video at successwithtyson.com forward slash 3ME for 3 Minute Expert. Hope you enjoy it. We'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.